And this week, the U.S. government did not clear for takeoff the proposed merger of American Airlines and U.S. Airways. The Justice Department says the merger would hurt competition and drive up ticket prices. But the two carriers say they are planning to fight on to become one. Tracy Tandon reports. In a surprise move, the U.S. Department of Justice filed a lawsuit this week challenging the $14 billion merger of American Airlines and U.S. Airways. It's a deal that would have created the world's largest airline. On Tuesday, U.S. Attorney General Eric Holder said, quote, this transaction would result in consumers paying the price in higher airfares, higher fees and fewer choices. Today's actions proves our determination to fight for the best interests of consumers by ensuring robust competition in the marketplace. The proposed merger comes after years of consolidation in the U.S. airline industry. Since 2005, U.S. Airways merged with America West Airways, Delta merged with Northwest Airlines, United joined forces with Continental and Southwest joined forces with AirTran. If American Airlines merged with U.S. Airways, only four carriers would control 80 percent of the U.S. market. That would make it easier for airlines to control prices. The Justice Department says if the American Airlines U.S. Airways merger goes through, it'll reduce competition for hundreds of routes. American Airlines parent company AMR says it's prepared to fight vigorously to achieve this merger. Even if this transaction goes through, and I expect that it ultimately will, you're going to have three major international carriers uh, in and out of the United States. Plus, uh, we have a lot of other carriers in the U.S., like uh, Southwest and JetBlue and others. So uh, any real argument that there is going to be no competition uh, you know, in the air in the U.S. Uh, is really going to be pretty hard to make. Although European regulators approved the merger, the U.S. Department of Justice still decided to file the lawsuit because they didn't want just four carriers bulldozing the rest of the competition. Both American Airlines and U.S. Airways says they are going to fight the lawsuit, expecting that their business plans eventually will be cleared for takeoff. Tracy Tandon, CCTV, New York.